Today we're here with Brooklyn Puckett, and today she spoke at FCA. So, Brooklyn, do you like speaking at FCA? Yeah, I really like it. I think it's definitely a way to get out of your shell and just spread the love of God. I really enjoy it. Was this your first time speaking here? Um, it actually wasn't. When I was in eighth grade, I spoke as a student, and it was pretty fun. Thank you. What's wrong, Preston? You look sad. Yeah, all this suicide prevention talks got me in the dumps. Well, what have you learned about suicide prevention? I've learned that 800,000 people die every year to suicide. Did you know that's one person per every 40 seconds? Make sure you're kind and polite to other people. It's not going to hurt you to go out of your way to compliment somebody. Make it your goal to compliment one person a day. Hey, every day. Hey, Haley, I like your shirt. Thanks, Georgia. I like it, too. Thanks, Preston. I like your attitude, Preston. Thanks, Georgia. I like your necklace. Thank you. Yes, I'm finally done with this homework. How? I'm not even on the third problem. This math homework is actually really hard. Well, if you work smarter and not harder, you can do it faster and a lot easier. First, turn your book around. Oh, that makes sense. You know, that should be quote of the week. That's a pretty good quote. Yes, it should. We're going to be playing knockout. We're all going to have a ball, and we're going to be dribbling and trying to knock each other's balls out. Whoever is dribbling their ball last wins, so okay. if it gets knocked out, the square you're out. Or if you pick your ball. I'm so. the square. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, go. Seventh grade list is Holes, Pandora of Athens, Hatchet, Maze Runner, and the Watson Guild of Birmingham. The eighth grade list is To Kill a Mockingbird, Hunger Games, and Frank, The Diary of a Young Girl, Harry Potter and the Sorcerer's Stone, and The Hobbit. So you can win a trip to go to the Mexican restaurant during lunch. What are we gonna do for the TikTok dance, Haley? I don't know, Georgia. I got an idea. <laughs> We're here with the book of the week, and it is called The Maze Runner by James Dashner. The Maze Runner is a book about this kid that wakes up in an elevator, and he has no memory of his life except that his name is Thomas. And as soon as the elevator door opens, he is surrounded by teenage boys, and they have to complete this maze. So make sure you read this. Here you Dang it sure is a good day to sit upside down. Yeah, and to look at your phone and read books, because today's going to be 85 and tomorrow's also going to be a good day to just sit out and uh, sit around on the porch. Wait, how did this? Something. I don't know. Today we're here with Leslie Garrett, and she's our student of the week. So we're just going to ask her a couple questions. So, Leslie, where do you like to eat? Taco Bell. What do you like to eat there? The Dorito Loco Taco. What do you like to do outside of school? Uh, play volleyball and ride pullers. So, that's Leslie. Hey, Sophie, what are you doing? I'm practicing for my game on Saturday. Um, the middle school lady Eagles play at 8.30. Uh, JV's at like 10, and then varsity plays at noon. Come out and support. And if you are a soccer player, I'm trying to recruit us a new player. So, Haley, show us what you got. Okay, this week's this or that question is cake or pie. Okay, so which one do you like more, cake or pie? Cake. Cake or pie? Cake. Cake or pie? Pie. I like cake more because of the icing and all the flavors in it. More flavors than pie. Hey, I'm 
Miss. Hope you're having a great Friday. We're here with Preston Chu, and he's going to tell us the Bible verse of the week. So the Bible verse of the week is John 11 and 35. Jesus wept. Hey, Preston, that seems really short. Yeah, it's actually the shortest one of them all. Interesting. That was Random your Bible fact. verse of the week. What are you thinking about eating tonight? Hmm, let me see. Pizza. Well, you're just in luck tonight. Well, all day is National Pepperoni Pizza Day. Yum. So it'd be the national day when you're eating pepperoni pizza. And I'll have a cup of punch to go with that. And it's also National Punch Day. Hey guys, this is Courtney Callaway, your staff member of the week. So what exactly do you do here at the middle school? I'm a student assistance coordinator, so come see me anytime you want. What's your favorite thing to do outside of school? Um, I love coaching soccer for the school. Coaching me? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, so do you have any kids? I have one little girl named Sarah Grace. She's the cutest two-month-old there is. And that was Courtney. Hey, I'm CMS. We're here with your word question of the week. Is UK or Louisville better? Let's go find out. We're here with Aiden and Miss Messley for your question of the week. And do you guys like UK or Louisville better? UK. UK. Okay. Do you like UK or Louisville better? Uh, I like UK. I like UK. Okay. Today we're here with Miss Brooks and Martin. And here lately, Miss Brooks has noticed Martin doing some random acts of kindness. What are some things that you've seen him do? Well, in the past few weeks, there's been some students that have been having trouble getting from class to class. And he's decided to just help them out and carry their books for them and walk them to class. And I think that's pretty awesome. Why do you do those things? Just be kind. Okay. We're here with Miss Allister, Teacher of the Week. Uh, Miss Allister, what do you like to do in your free time? Camp. And what is your favorite class to teach? Probably health. Do you have any pets? I do. I have a weenie dog named Squirrel. Oh, is he cute? She's cute, yes. Oh. Uh, <laughs> what do you like about the middle school? You all. Oh. <laughs> I'm Natalie. And I'm Seth. And we're here with your joke of the week. Which way did the programmer go? What? That away. Hey, Matthew, do you know that in Spain there's a festival of tomatoes? And it was this week, and the people literally painted the town red with tomatoes. Whoa! Do you like tomatoes? Uh, like in soup and stuff. Oh, they're pretty good. Uh, also, in the uh, Netherlands, the they're making bee hotels to help the bee population. It's like a bee movie. Yeah. And also, they saved some California hikers with a bottle. It's like the Sting song. Message yeah. in a bottle. Bees? Sting? That's a weird connection. Yeah. You know, hey, now that I remember, you want to go with me to the, the fair down the county uh, county park this weekend? Heck yeah, bro. Yeah. This week's riddle of the week is... I am very easy to get into, but very hard to get out of. What am I? If you think you know it, email this address, and the first person to get the answer right will be interviewed on the news. Good luck! Okay, so today we're here with Russell and we're going to ask him a would you rather question. Alright, would you rather go to the Bahamas or Hawaii? Hawaii. Why? Because I don't know what the um, Bahamas are. Okay. <laughs> okay, so Stephen, Bahamas or the Hawaii? Hawaii. Why? Because I like the sand. Okay. So Emily, the Bahamas or Hawaii? Hawaii. Why? Because I've never been to uh, Hawaii before. Okay. This week's Ethan Curry winner of the week is uh, Lynn M. from Miss Tartar's Harbor. This is your You've Been Caught Reading one of the week, and uh, what's your favorite book? Maze Runner. Maze Runner? Okay. Uh, what book are you reading now that you got cre caught reading with? Maze Runner. Oh, okay. That's convenient. Um, what do you like reading, of, like, what do you like about reading so much? Probably the interesting story plots. Yeah, I, I like reading too, quite a bit. Uh, that's your, you've been caught reading one of the week, and you want a chocolate bar. So if you want a chocolate bar, then read in class. So today here, we're here with Rosie. And she has a hidden talent. This is Stitch. Her hammer means family. Family means not brush itself behind. And this is Yoshi. Rushing. Thank you.